Hey, what's up everyone? My name is George and this is SAS Master. Today we're going to check out XFunnels. This is a funnel builder. I think it's a pretty interesting software and I'm pretty amazed of how the web builder is on this XFunnels software. So right now you can grab XFunnels for a lifetime deal. That means you pay once and you can use it forever. So that means no monthly bills. Now, what is a funnel? In a quick term, it's like it's a type of sequence to generate leads or generate sales. So what it's going to do is like, so for example, if you try to generate leads, you go soft. Maybe you want to give out a webinar, maybe an ebook, and through that ebook, you capture that lead. And through that lead, then you generate a sell, and it's like a sequence. Same goes for a sell. Maybe you want to give out a free ebook first, and then you try to do like a soft sell, and then you do like a hard sell, and then you can do an upsell or a, a, a down sell. So it's a sequence to build and sell more. So instead of just trying to sell in right out with a website, you use a funnel. I mean, that's just a, like a really basic. Uh, trying to get out there for you guys so you understand what a funnel is but this video is about x funnel so let's just dig right into x funnels this is the x funnels dashboard right here and like i said you can buy it for a lifetime deal you pay once and you can use it forever instead of paying monthly so for example this is click funnels and monthly it's 97 dollars and you're not even getting like one third of what X Funnels is giving you and for a lifetime. So it's pretty much really expensive. They're charging that because they're the first players, they're the most, they're like the, the leaders out there and they charge a lot. So X Funnels is a good software that works great and they got really nice templates that you can use. So to dig, dig right into uh, X Funnels, we're gonna head on over to not my dashboard right here and this is the dashboard that you're going to be greeted with in x funnels so once you can see right here is a total funnels total revenue with that funnel total pages total views and total opt-ins this is a demo account so there's not a lot of details in here but i'm going to show you what it's capable of now the best part right here is my funnels pages so this is where the action comes and we're going to create a brand new funnel right here and we're going to call this oh not yet we're going to select the type of funnel that we want so what it's trying to do is trying to give you an overview it's trying to help you with a template of what you might need if you are going to use these case scenarios so right here with the sales funnel which would be the most common one you got product lunch membership email live webinar replay webinar crowdfunding and e-commerce so the most popular one would be i say i would say sales funnel and the other one would be email let's keep it in sales funnel and let's go next and let's call this one testing one and we can add a tag we can add a logo in this case we're not going to do that and we're just going to call this anything we want you can also do a custom domain oops got a space around here all right there we go and we click next once we click next we got a sequence to start off let's just wait for it to load a bit all right so this is a sequence that x funnels recommends so you can see right here this is a four step sequence and you can add more steps you can remove steps and just whatever you want right so this is just a recommendation there's no sites built into the sequence right now but you can order them however you want in this case for example the order form if we click on this down arrow it's gonna open the way that we can choose a template. Now, something that's really cool about X Funnels is that you got a split testing option. So you can add a template right here and you can create a second template for this one right here. And it's gonna start doing one and the other. It's gonna start testing. And at the end of the day, you can select which one is better and works most. Or maybe this template had more sales than the other. So hey, keep the one that has more sales, obviously. So let's just choose a template right here. And we can start from scratch. We can choose a template. Look how nice these templates look. So they're pretty nice. You can select one of these. You can preview them or select a template. So in this case, um, I'm going to select this one right here. Now, don't worry if you like something about a certain template because later on you can add a module from that template also. So for example, I loaded the template right here and I can edit the page over here. I'm going to create a quick variation just to show you that it's possible to do the split testing. It's super easy. Now I'm going to select this template. And now I have two of them. Now I can say split this test into 50 50 percent or you can move one to the other. So maybe you think one is better. Just you can go a little bit further to the other one. All right. So once you choose a template, we can go to edit page and it's going to open. Now they got the X Funnels Builder 3.0 that I think it's really flexible. Um, honestly, I was amazed on how easy it is to um, build and move around things. I'm not trying to hype the product. I just think it's really nice. I mean, 
you're gonna see it for yourself right here. What makes it a good product is that it's easy to use in my point of view. So let's wait for it to load and get going. All right, so here's our template, it's loaded now. And if we hover over any of these like modules right here, we can edit them. So if I click on this one right here, the editor opens on the right. Now when I say this is flexible, I mean it's flexible. If I grab this button and I say I don't want it here, I can drag it over here. I can drag it anywhere in the page and it's gonna load fine. So there you go. It's it's not like other type of builders where it's like uh, a block and you gotta stay in that block and it's divided into four blocks or one third of a block and you gotta stay there. It's really hard to make things go right. So in this case, you can move it anywhere around. So it's kind of like, you know what, like Divi Builder, like Wix, where it's a really flexible builder. It's kind of like that, but in here. So for example, if I click on contact me, I can do settings, I can change the label, contact me now. You can do submit a form. So what mode do you want to do this? It's like submit form, opt-in, hyperlink, contact us, uh, pop-up button or funnel step. You go um, form method, get or post, form action. You can change the colors, you can add shadows. So for example, in this shadow, I can select like, I don't know, black, that's okay. And you can add a shadow right here. So see how that shadow is showing right there? Do some blur. And there you go, it added shadow. Over here, remember I told you, maybe there's something that you like. You saw on another preview that you like a module, especially from that one. So you wanna drag that in. So on the left right here, we got all the blocks that we can add. So we got preset blocks, we got shapes, headings, paragraph, image, video, countdowns, modal pop-up, all these options, text areas, socials, and options. So let's click on module. It's gonna hide this right here. And here in module, we got a bunch of modules from the templates that we can grab just what we want. So for example, maybe you liked a header from a certain template, you can grab it. So for example, you can select right here, features, descriptions, and just grab something right here. So if I like, for example, this footer, all right, I can insert that footer and insert it right there. See how easy that is? I can move that footer, I can delete that footer, I can keep it or just do whatever I want with that. So in a sense, it's really flexible. In this video, I'm not gonna get into editing this thing because I mean, I could just click right here and start editing, but we're gonna lose a lot of time. What's a, what's more important here is that XFunnels is easy, easy to use and it works. So you got these options right here. And if you like what you're looking at, you can save it or you can delete it. In this case, I'm just gonna click and I'm gonna leave but it's easy. So this is one of the funnel process. So it's one of the sequence. This, the next sequence, obviously we create another page and we can also do A-B testing if we like. Um, you're gonna notice that some type of pages sell more than the other and that's what split testing is for. Once you like how all the funnel is built, you can click on finish. So in this case, like I said, I'm not gonna build a full funnel. I'm just trying to show you what XFunnels is capable of and it's easy to do. So once you're ready, you can grab a link right here. So just click right here and I have a link to copy the URL. So what am I gonna use this for? Let's just say I'm doing a Facebook ads and I wanted to go into this funnel when someone clicks on that ad. So if they want, if I'm selling something, if I'm gonna give away something, if, I mean, whatever we're gonna do, it's gonna go into that funnel. Now you can also do a custom domain with the settings if you wanna do that. If you don't want to use the domain from XFunnels, that is possible also. But there you go guys, that is XFunnels on this part. We can also create, this is my orders, but we can create our products and we can sell directly in the XFunnels. So I'm just gonna click on this one really quick to show you what it's capable of. So you can sell digital products, you can sell physical products and do all the information right here, all the sales information and all that good stuff. So you can create the products that you can actually sell in that funnels. So like I said, it's even more flexible and more powerful than click funnels in that sense. Also, you have available, depending on the plan that you pay for, it's the agency management. So if you wanna add team members to this, so if for example, I add a team member, it's name, email, password, and they can access this information also. So all that's available in ClickFunnels. Let me go back, sorry. It's a flexible software. It's inexpensive compared to paying monthly to with other guys. Uh, you pay once and you have it forever. That means it's a lifetime deal. There you go, guys. That's X Funnels. If you guys think it's interesting, give it a like. And if you like the video, subscribe. Thank you for watching. My name is George and this is SaaS Master.